Question 18, very important, you know it's got one of these stars next to it. That means the quality of the way you write things down is very important. You must write each step, explain what you're doing, etc. Okay, it says triangle ABC is a right angle triangle. So I'm going to firstly uh, draw what I mean by that. ABC is this one. Okay, and they're saying that's a right angle triangle. So I'm just going to group that and I'm going to colour it. Um, just so that we've got, a, there's triangle ABC, okay, and it's in red. ADB is a straight line, so ADB is a straight line, and I'm going to just say let's colour that green or something, so we know what we're talking about. Okay, A, D, B is a straight line. D, A equals D, C. So D to A, that distance there is the same as D to C. And hence, this triangle here, this triangle is an isosceles triangle. If these two sides are the same and that's different, this is an isosceles triangle. So I'm just going to colour in the isosceles triangle for us. That there is an isosceles triangle. Okay, so in particular, if that angle is x, that angle must be x as well, all right? Because it's got two of the same angles. Now, angle BCD is 20, B to C to D, this one here is 20, right? Work out the size of the angle marks x. You must state with reasons your workings, etc. Okay, now firstly, angles in a triangle add to 180 degrees. Okay, state that fact down. Therefore, you know that this angle here, which is the angle, let's say, CDB, angle CDB, it's always the angle C to D to B, always over the middle one, must be equal to 180 degrees for the whole triangle. Take away 90, take away 20. So take away 90, take away 20. Now 90 and 20 are 110, so 180 take away 110 is equal to 70 degrees. So this angle here is 70 degrees. Right, does that help us at all? Well it means we can work out this angle here. Angle, and I'm going to call it um, CDA, CDA, this one here, well that is on a, st a straight line. Okay, that is on a straight line with this 70, so that must be 110 is because it's on a straight line. Okay, so that's 110. Now x, therefore, we know that these two angles are the same, so therefore 2x's must be, this triangle must add up to 180, this is 110, so 2x's must be 70 degrees. These two must add up to 70, so 1x must be 35 degrees. Again, angles in triangle equal 180 degrees. You must state why. And we're done for that question.